Hey guys, it's Commander Blondie here with some more Hearthstone. We are playing Black Rock Mountain. The once I load up, the Blackwing Lair. Let's go ahead and open them up. So there are actually four bosses in this one, and we will start off with. Razor Gore. Alright, so Razor Gore. Give all corrupted eggs plus one health, then summon another one. So we have to figure out what this corrupted egg is, and I'll go ahead and go Hunter. So in WoW, actually, Razor Gore had um, eggs that you had to control him to destroy the eggs. Um, so I'm actually really hoping that they do something with that, if it loads up. Yeah, so I'm hoping that um, some, there's some mechanic where you have to control Razor Gore himself and have him hit the egg. Mm. I'll go ahead and toss the Arcane Golem. So that costs one mana, but it's called, it's cast every turn. So I really... Oh, right, let's see what this does. And this minion has four more health at hatches. And it gives them all one... Alright, well... Rush seems to be the way to go. He's probably playing clear, but this will stop him. Yeah. So this is... I mean, this, this might be... Really, really easy, or I am just not gonna. He does say that actually. So, okay, what's he got? The clear, yep. So I definitely have to keep. Oh, ho, ho, hello. Just no face, that's good. Here? That's good. Here. Actually, that's one. Okay. Perfect. That was... That's how you call stuff. I don't even... <laughs> that hit everything that I wanted. Corruption on the 3-2, of course. Yep. So we'll get some value out of it by hitting, uh, hopefully, the... Uh, yeah, we'll try to hit this. Yeah, there we go. And then that can... Alright. So you definitely want to play an early game um, deck with this or a uh, AoE heavy, like mage deck. Priest might work because these things can be destroyed at any time with the... Uh, whatever it's called. The... Uh, um, I'm blanking. With the Shadow Word Pain. So I'm, I'm just going to let one live, because I'm kind of curious as to what it does. Does he have a dragon? He does have a dragon. So I'll get, I'll get him down low, and then I'll see what happens. So we'll go ahead and trade. 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 Trade, trade. Hit face. Two. All right. So now I can kill him whenever I want. So I, uh, I it's just one more turn. So what's this? If you're holding a dragon, deal three damage. Huh. All right. Well, I'll go ahead and clear this guy and ping him one more time. End my turn. All right. What does that do when it reaches four health? It actually worked out perfectly. All right. So it's at four health. So, holy crap, that's a big dragon. Okay. Yeah, don't let those things pop. That's a 7-3. All right. GG. So, yeah, he's, he's really easy with the right deck. I, I really like the eggs. Um, I'm sorry. But uh, it's unfortunate you didn't make him hit them, but oh well. Next is dragon... Yep. 
Oh, well, that'd mean to. Each player draws two cards. Um. I'm not sure what deck would be good against that. <laughs> Definitely not one with draw, so Warlock's out. Um, Rogue might be pretty good. Yeah, let's go with Rogue. This is Mech Rogue. Um, so I don't know what the mechanics for this, uh, this boss was. But, uh, he is a giant red dragon that just breathes fire. I think he puts, uh, debuffs on you, but I don't remember. It probably doesn't affect this boss fight, but we'll see. He does say that. So maybe he won't do anything. So that's why he's... Oh, that's gonna... Oh, alright. I, I have an idea. His hero power might change um, like three or so turns in. Um, he did have a lot of health. Oh, no. I thought he had 45 health. Hmm. Um, oh, well, maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Yep. Oh, well. He's already corrupt. Um, so, we've got something to play. So he's probably just going to go for overdrawing me, which is kind of an annoying tactic for a bot to use. Gang up. <laughs> oh boy, he's going for overdrawing me. And I'm going to overdraw here too. Oh, that's a really good one too. Hunter would have been better here. Oh god. Stop, no. No more. No more. Oh, God. That's unfortunate. And I just tossed this. Oh, my God. Ow. Okay. Well, you can go away. I'm just going to eviscerate his face. I'm already on 13 cards. Oh, if, if, if this works like normal, he doesn't have any more... Um, Burning... Wait, wait, what was that card? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, he doesn't have any more naturalizes, which is good. He does have an 8-8, eight, eight, though. Jeez. Um, and I can't play more than one card, which means he's going to overdraw me by two again. Um, let's see if he kills the Yeti. Ah, uh, yeah, he does that anyway first. Ah, uh, he gets the set. That's actually fine with me. Mmm, ow. Uh, well, I could trade here just so the corruption's wasted and so is that card, so I don't overdraw. Mill would be really good against him. Um. One five, alright. We'll go with Mimron. Because we can play two cards every turn now, so that's pretty nice. Corruption on the 4-5. Uh, hmm. Alright, that's odd. <laughs> Deal two damage to the enemy here. Alright. I do have one of my Annoyatrons in hand, though, so that's not too bad. So actually play three here. Um, at the start of the corrupting... Okay, yeah, so this is going to die next turn anyway. Might as well trade. Ugh, I wonder if that fatigues. If it does, I, I might just lose instantly. <laughs> That's fine. Am I at 10 cards? I think I am. Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> this is stupid. Um... I am kind of lost here, to be honest. Might as well do it like this. Uh, yeah, he kind of just wins here, right? If he trades 8, 9, 10, yep. Yeah. I do want to see if this fatigues me, though. It fatigues you, oh my god. Well then, that's a, that's a really interesting bot. Oh, and he has that, too. He's stealing my Annoyotron. I mean, I'm dead anyway, so... Okay. <laughs> He's just not killing me. Yep, there. There it is. Yep. Sad. That's a 913, too. Well, then. 
Rush or Mill? Because I'm not like nothing else is gonna work. Uh, I really want to try Mill. So we'll see how that goes. It should it should work if I get the right cards early, like um if I get my own naturalizes, because I don't want to play any cards, so he can't naturalize my cards and overdraw me. Don't want the sapper. So I want um, what cards do I want? Like dancing swords. It's, eh, it's bad. It's good not to have uh, too many low drop minions, though. Yeah, Wrath is good, so is Swipe. <sighs> this is... I don't like this already. <laughs> I don't have any of my low drops, which is unfortunate, and I can't just Wrath this phase. Death Lord is really good. Especially if I, if I have a Naturalize. <sighs> no, it's not that good. <laughs> Jeez. Um, damn, if I had a naturalize in this hand, that would be amazing. Psh, psh, psh. Well, Goblin Sapper, since he has a lot of cards, too. Swipe, that's good. Ah, oh, I lost the cold light. Of all things. That's not going to do too much. All face, too. Um, oh no, not, I'm losing all my good cards. So we'll do this trade. If he has naturalize, I probably just lose. Because I overdraw anyway. Implosion's fine, as long as he doesn't get a four. Oh my god. I just want mana right now so I can play more. Holy crap. I really don't want him to have a naturalize. That would be terrible. <laughs> Force of nature. There's my naturalize. There we go. He is putting a lot... Okay. So, uh, that's a really good... Mm, and there's his naturalize. See, it looks like rush is the only way to go with this. There's an innervate. <laughs> that's pretty silly. Swipes. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm, I could still win here. We'll see. It's an innervate gone. So we definitely want to naturalize this. Um. I want to swipe this so I can wrath it. For three. And unfortunately, I can't hero power kill it, but I just kill it like this. Not a cold light? Good. Uh, Lower Theb isn't the best because you don't get the battle cry, but it's still okay. Sweet, he tosses the other naturalized. That's good. Can silence that. But I kind of just want to force a nature, but that's not really amazing. Oh, wow, I almost pulled the wrong card. Um, wait. Hmm. Gotta do some quick math. Mm hmm. Ah, uh, if I silence this, I can't kill it. That's the problem. What if it, it dies to most other things? Uh, yeah, I think I'm just gonna hero power this turn anyway. So can I play two cards and hero power? Uh, I mean, one extra mana is good. And then this hero power. Alright. I am getting kind of low, but next turn I have double druid. And hopefully this isn't my other code light. You know, it's getting very likely that it is. Ooh, sapper. That's amazing. There's my cold light. Tree of life. That's pretty good. Uh, I can't silence both of those. That's fine. It dies next turn anyway. Okay. Face. Face. Ow. Ow. I probably have to tree next turn. Oh, okay. God damn it. 
All right, then. These are definitely getting harder. I'm <laughs> Wolf. <laughs> I'm hoping that... Uh, you, you have to play Rush. Jeez. I mean, there's... Pulling two cards every turn if you don't have low drops. And while most decks have low drops... Hmm. I suppose it might work if you play... um. Druid, and you might have wild growths, but Rush just fully counters this pretty much. Like, he has arcane missiles, but like, what, what is arcane missiles gonna do against a haunted creeper? I don't really care which one I play. Uh, and <laughs> drawing like this actually helps Rush. That's good. Yeah, oh well. It's just kind of whatever. I mean, it's a card for a card. So. He's going to draw me two more cards. So, I mean, I got like three draw. Oh, all right. It's, it still doesn't matter, though. Because I get these two from here. Though I am. Oh, jeez. All right. It's still, oh my god, that's kind of crazy, that it's still okay that, um, oh, come on, let me play it. It's still okay on what he did, alright, even though he played so much. Alright, my hand is starting to get full, yeah, I think I'm gonna, am I gonna overdraw? I think so. If he draws that next turn, I'm going to be in big trouble. Um, so we'll go ahead and just go full face. And, eh, that was kind of a misplay because I played the Glaive Zuka after attacking. It's going to buff that guy up. Oh well, that's one missed damage. I'm more concerned with playing my cards at the moment, though. Yeah, that's fine. So he's already down lower than I actually got him last time. Alright. So. <clears throat> I don't have any one drop, so I might as well just do this. Yeah, oh, I forgot to. <clears throat> Not that it matters too much. He's kind of just screwed with my hand. I've got 3, 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Yeah, he's completely screwed. Oh, is this going to be giant or tons of molten giants turn? Let's see how lucky he is. That's not that lucky. Yeah, well, I mean, that's kind of ridiculous. Just play rush and everything. Jeez. Oh, the mage. Oh, I think you get, yeah, you get Cro-Magus. Why is he... Add a Brew Affliction card to your opponent's hand. Um, We're just going to have to try it. Because I have no idea what a Brew Affliction card is. Um, What he originally does is he periodically stuns you. He burns you. Uh, two other things that I remember. We'll see. From Roar. Well, it's, I'm not sure. It might just be something to fill, you, fill your hand, but I don't think it will be. His deck might be crazy and it might be beneficial, but I think it's going to be negative. Oh, I get turn one. No coin. I'm good enough reason. What's this do? Restore two health to your opponent at the start of your turn. Okay. So yeah, basically they're cards you want to get out of your hand. Alright, that's... Yeah, alright. That's fine. I don't particularly care about that Brutal Affliction card. He's full health anyway. He still has full health. <laughs> Hello. That's one of the more stupid plays. Ow! Ugh. <laughs> 
Alright, that's still fine though. He's perfect. Chromagus. Okay, I need to get rid of that one because that one's probably bad. Which is fine though. I don't mind taking the one damage and I can play this and then do this. Uh, yeah, I'll trade here. That's cool how they burn like that. It shows them. Ooh, bite. Oh my god. Druid. What is this? It's minions? Okay. I don't want to watch that. I don't want to keep that one in my hand. Uh, I'll just play this. So it looks like that's... Um, I think those are all. Take one damage to the face. Heals him. Um, oh, no, black. Never. He gets a copy of it. That's not good. Um, so let's get that out. That's pretty good. Don't wanna. Actually, I kinda wanna heal this. And I'll play this. And smack his face. I'm gonna wanna get rid of green soon. Cause I'm gonna start hitting his face. Is someone a random. Okay. That's one of the better one ones. Ooh, he can stack them up. Oh, that's really bad. <laughs> um, looks like I'm going to be playing a lot of them this turn, though. Blood him. Alright, that's fine. Uh, yeah, three mana to take out all of his buffs. That's fine. Um, what do we want to do now, though? I'll trade like this, like this, and then... Go all face. I don't particularly care about the hungry dragon. It's gonna kill anything it hits, so might as well let him trade into me. Whenever your opponent casts a spell, game plus two plus two. That's a cool card. It's like a super um. What's that card? Oh, and these are spells. Oh my god. <laughs> That's really good. Well, it's gonna be a legendary this turn anyway. Probably Dr. Boom. He affects the board better. And then I'll trade like this and get rid of that guy. But they're like the bigger version of, um... Whatever the card is. The troll. The Rockjaw troll or something. Oh, that's a good swipe. I, I mean, it's a, it's a bad swipe, but it's a good swipe. How did that live? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, that was buffed by the Blood Imp. Alright. Alright, so I'll toss that out. Hit his face and play the Shredder. Alright, that's a cool deck. I like that. Mm hmm? Can you play a dragon after that? No? Okay. I think that's game. Yeah, that's game. Alright, GG. Debatably easier than the other two. <laughs> Though the, fir uh, the first one wasn't too hard. It just had a cool gimmick. <laughs> okay. Hungry Jack, one of the better cards, I believe. 5-6, it's really good stats. Oh, hello. Okay, so this is definitely going to be an interesting uh, fight. So I'm going to play what I think my best deck is, Garrosh, Warrior, because I pretty much have... Uh, complete deck with this one. I'm still kind of tweaking the others, but you know. So, he's probably going to assume his true form next turn. So, Axe and Taskmaster probably. Ah, that's not really. Alright. Oh well. Kind of scared to end turn, but here we go. Get it now. Oh my god, no. So, he's going to do it. He's going to turn into a dragon. Yup. What? No. That's, that's not... What? <laughs> what? Um, get out of my face. Um, uh, <laughs> what? I mean, I'm fine with... Okay, oh my god, now I understand, holy shit, that's a lot of armor. 
in WoW, he actually did that too, but he, uh, I don't remember, he made you, he made you weak somehow. I don't remember how. Holy shit. Warrior's a good choice, but I don't have executes at the moment. Yeah, that's, that would be helpful. That's pretty good. Alright. 4 or 5 when Fury trades. If he doesn't trade, I'll... Can you not? Can you not? <laughs> oh my god. Can I have more cards? Oh, that's that's a really good one to get for defending this guy. Ow. Um, bit more help rag. Just a little bit. Alright. Thank you. That's, I don't really like these four or five wind furies, but all right. Uh, nothing I can really do. I mean, I can execute the six four, but that's a kind of a meh because I expect him to have bigger cards. But we'll have to wait and see. Oh, oops. Oh, I saw that as a four five or a four six. Oh well, that's hmm. all right. So that's a bite. Holy shit! Can you not? Did he just win? Oh. All right. I mean, so basically, you just get whirling ashes all day. But I don't have executes. I mean, I don't mind the the whirling ashes are really nice and all, but I'm just kind of dead. Cause you, eh, all right. I mean, hey, I can hit you for a lot of damage. <laughs> all right, let's try that again. Yeah. Hmm. So, I still think warrior is the way to go. You just need executes. Like you need um, maybe Mil no nah, Mildred would not work. You need to get board presence. Druid might work. Something to maybe have Moria <laughs> come in here and stop his hero power. Brawl. I don't want to keep brawl. It's too late game. All right, let's. All right, let's start. <laughs> Hello, big scary dragon thing. That's so unfair. <laughs> At least he gives you a turn to set up, but I don't have anything early. I mean, rush might work, but he's just gonna clear. I mean, maybe Mill, but he's got freaking 10 mana. I think he starts with that freaking start. Uh, and Rag is going to give me the... Oh, wait. Oh, shit. Alright, so he, d he gives you different cards. Ah, right. Which means I'm going to take 6 damage next turn. More technicians. No, stop it. God damn. Can I have another... Uh, actually, just AoE, maybe. Like, five, four damage AoE. Can I have a flame strike for free? Or is that not a thing? Holy shit. I can't imagine what heroic Nefarian would be like. Oh, that's a good one. I will take that. 6-6. Six, six. Alright. This is going to hurt, but going for that. If he can kill that without trade... Oh! Why did I play warrior? Tail swipe. 
Oh. My face. I'm gonna take a five damage next turn. Alright. The Ash. Oh. I'm gonna save that one, actually. So I'm gonna take a lot of damage doing this, but I don't need to kill that. That's only a 2-2. Two, two. Six damage is a lot. Zero cost fireball. That's 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 dead. All right. I mean, yeah, that's fine. I don't really care about that. Actually, is he easy to trade? That would kind of suck if he just killed that. All right, that's fine. All right. So the Sun of Flame is going to be useful to me. Oh, oh, I don't want to play that actually. Um. We'll shield maiden, we'll trade here, we'll trade here, and we'll end. Alright, another six damage. Just hiding. Where were these things last game? I had freaking four or five wind fury. Oh, that's fine. That's not fine. He got both of these from his stupid wild magic. Uh I suppose that's fine. It it had low health anyway. Mm. That's good. <sighs> mm. That's actually kind of good. Mm. Is that worth? There's the whirling ash again. All right, I think I've, uh, I think I've stabilized actually. Ah, uh, the first one was fine, but this one isn't. Uh, that's kind of the only one that I didn't want to survive. Um, we still have the Sun of Flame, though, that's... Well, let's wait. I don't need to use that yet, either. So we'll do this, this, armor up. Alright, I think, I think this is going well. I, I'm pretty sure he's gonna have a change of phase like Kilfazad. Uh, is that on the Sneeds? That's fine. Oh, I'll take that. <laughs> Hello, Crush. <laughs> I technically doesn't have charge, but that's gonna do one to everything. That's so. Good. That's actually really good for me. What are you doing, Nefarian? <laughs> All right. Please don't be a buff. All right. I kind of want to play these, but having fr how much damage is that? Twelve, twenty damage in reserve is so nice. I don't want to cue a change of phase with no answers in my hand. I don't want to get, let him get another brawl, though. Is that going to... Alright, that's fine. Alright, oh. Um, Alright. I'll face... If I get another Sun of Flame, I'm just going to play it. Did I not get it? Okay, so maybe I can only have three drag cards. In my oh, I almost... I am not playing the right cards. <laughs> um, no change of phase. All right, let's just go all in. That's... what? How much did I... Did I just win? Oh, thank you, Rag. Thank you. That, um, oh, that taunt saved my ass. That taunt really just, that, uh, that was a good save by that. 
And it, it was like a 6-6 six, six taunt. Yeah, that was nice. And there's Cro-Magus. Those class challenges, but I will have to do those later because, oh my god. I wasn't even paying attention to the um, cards I was getting. That was just a really fun wing. And bite, oh my god. Uh, so we got the Flame Walker. Whenever you cast a spell, deal two damage uh, to, like, split. Uh, it's not... Uh, Flame Guard Destroyer. Could be a 7-6 for 4. Could be really good, or it could just be a 4-6 for 4, which is still not bad. Uh, Revenge. The uh, Anti-Rush. Uh, this one is... And there was Hungry Dragon. And was there something else? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I, uh, I'm i sorry, I, I honestly wasn't paying attention. There's the Hungry Dragon. Summon a 1 cost, but it's a 5-6 for 4, which is really nice. Was there something else that I'm missing? Oh yeah, Chromagus. <laughs> whenever, you, whenever you draw a card, put another copy into your hand. That could That is debatably amazing. Debatably terrible. <laughs> Though I think it's more amazing. 6-8, not amazing stats for an 8-8, eight, eight, considering. Um, but uh, it will put your hand, it'll fill your hand really fast. But in a hunter deck where you just toss all your minions out anyway, Chromagus could be amazing. But in a hunter deck where you toss out all your cards, you're not going to play that long. So personally, I think this is a druid card. But we'll see. But yeah, that was the Blackwing Lair. Or, yeah, yeah, Blackwing Lair. And next up, Hidden Laboratory. Where we actually get Nefarian, finally. But yeah, it's been Commander Blondie, guys. Peace out.